Hey everyone, Kat here, and today I have an Angelic Pretty unboxing for you guys. There was a winter sale, and a lot of dresses were marked down to 40% and 50% off. So I bought three dresses um, the day before my birthday, so they're sort of a birthday present, but I am selling quite a few of my dresses because I'm cleaning out my wardrobe for the new year. So if there are any of the dresses that I own that you've been eyeing, you could check. I'll leave the Lace Market link down below with all of the dresses that I have listed will be on there. Um, but yeah, so hopefully I will make enough money back to justify that these dresses weren't birthday presents and they were just replacements in my wardrobe. Anyways, I know today I'm wearing Alice in the Pirates to unbox the Angelic Pretty. Sort of blasphemy, I guess. Um, but I didn't get to wear this dress on my birthday because it was cold and I didn't want to be like cold, I don't know. I, I just ended up wearing normal clothes on my birthday. So I wanted to wear it today and um, I don't know if I'm really feeling these tassels. I figured since it's like an Arabian print dress and it's blue like jasmine that I could go for a jasmine look with a wig and the makeup came out okay but the the wig's not doing it for me today and I really don't like these tassels but since I'm doing a unboxing of the angelic pretty dresses I'll try them on anyways and I'll change but I figured I would leave it for now and get your input on it I want to do more of a jasmine cord so if you have ideas for what I could do to throw to together a jasmine cord for this outfit let me know so um, I ripped open the box tab area already so you wouldn't have to hear that but I haven't actually taken anything out besides the little order form so I have my little like don't look at my shipping address. I have my little cute drawing that they always put on there. It's so cute. I love it. And she has like cute little like hime bangs and it looks like a little bat wing cape, which I really want that angelic pretty bat wing cape. I need to get my hands on that. But uh, let's open it. Whoa. Okay. So there are three dresses wrapped together in here. No AP bags right now, but I have tons of AP bags now, so I'm not gonna complain. Just a little. So the first dress is this Astro Measurement jumper skirt in the Saks colorway. And I really love this colorway because it reminds me of Buzz Lightyear. And I really wanted to do a Buzz Lightyear or Pixar cord. And so that is why I really wanted this dress when it first came out, because I saw it and I was like, all of my Buzz dreams can come true. And this is so nice quality. It's a different material than any Angelic Pretty dress I've ever had before. And it's box pleats, which I really love box pleats with Lolita. And I haven't ever looked at this in detail really closely before because I wasn't going to get it unless it went on sale. And it did! And they, this was the only color jumper skirt left and this was the color I wanted, so I'm really excited about it. But it has really pretty embroidery right here on the patch, cute little stars silver lace details and silver on here on the ribbon it's really nice and the lace is just AP with stars the back um, when I get these crisscrosses to work right it's supposed to make like a star on your back it doesn't have shearing but I think it should fit it looks like it'll fit it looks pretty sizable so I think I'll be safe with this I really like it so far. I'm going to try it on in just a second, but right now let's move on to the next dress. So this next one is the first OP I've ever bought. I usually don't fit into OPs because I have quite large shoulders, and so if there's no shearing or anything, I can't zip it up in the back comfortably and then lift my arms, so I'm hoping this one will work because it looked like it was a little bit more of a free-flowing cut. And I just really love the OP more than I like the jumper skirt, and the skirt was really cute. I might get the skirt another time. I really want the red skirt, the red and black polka dot one, but this is Dolly Dot, and when this first came out, I was madly in love with it, especially the OP, and it's really rare for me to love OPs as much as I love this one. It's just so gorgeous. I love the heart detail in the print that has Angelic Pretty in it. I just think that's so cute, and I love polka dots, so I am so in love with this. I love it. I love it. Oh, it's so cute. I can't wait to try this on. Hopefully it fits right. For the last dress, I actually don't... Uh, Magic Amulet. Okay, Magic Amulet. When this dress came out, I was like all for it. Like, yeah, 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 I want it, I want it. And then I like looked at it closer and it had like Star of Davids and crosses and too much stuff at first for me to like it. But the more I looked at it, the more it grew on me. And eventually I fell in love with it, especially in this colorway. So when I saw that it went on sale, I was like... Ah, uh, I really, really, really want it. I love this kind of green-blue color, as you can see here. My wardrobe is turning into blue and lavender only, and I'm 
getting rid of everything else I feel like but I love this color it's gorgeous and the Star of David doesn't really bother me all that much it's not horrible it's kind of weird though because it's a Ouija board I didn't know that when I first saw the print but now looking it up close it's a Ouija board inside the Star of David with um, the I feel like this is the the moon with the stars is Muslim right so there's that then there's the star of David then there's a Ouija board in it that says like yes no hello all the way goodbye with a cross right there and then there's this angelic pretty AP up here a clock for some reason another star of David with a unicorn constellation in it and um, this magic circle that has a candelabra, another Star of David with a, looks like an Egyptian cat in it, and a cross, a chalice, the fish, the Jesus fish, <laughs> cross, oh there's an onk in there. Um, yeah, I think it's really pretty, and I think stars are stars are stars no matter what, and clocks are clocks are clocks, and all this stuff is pretty cool. I don't know, I just really like the color. So, this is Dolly Dot on me. Now, it actually fits. I zipped it all the way up. I got everything tied, and it is actually so cute. It's really comfortable. I love this dress. I didn't tie my waist ties very well because Dean's not here to help me tie them. It fits my petticoat underneath it. I just have one petticoat. The one I usually wear under Alice in the Pirate dresses. I could probably fit a ton more because, you know, it's angelic pretty. It has pockets. One pocket. Two pocket. It has two pockets. Yes, we're good here. I like this. And I just, oh, it's so cute. I like it. I usually don't like OPs, but this is going to be like a really comfortable dress to just throw on and wear and look really cute in. I'm so in love with this. So, 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 so in love. Glad I got it. And I'm wearing my cute little hat from my Taobao haul the other day. And I just love this dress. I don't know. I'm like really in love with it. Shall we try on the next one? Let's go! So, this is Magic Amulet. I couldn't get the straps attached in the back, so it's not all the way on properly right now. Um, but it's so cute. I really like it. I, my boobs may be a little too big for this. I don't know. They're just doing a thing. So maybe a different bra next time or, you know, lose some weight, cat, and then maybe it'll lose it in your boobs. But your boobs are good for other things, just not for Lolita. I don't know. I feel like I might be loafing a little bit. Maybe if I can adjust it and pull it down. Sometimes I wear these with like a little bow right here or a belt to make it because my waist is actually down here. I'm very tall, so a lot of these things that are even supposed to be regular waist cut are like short on me. <laughs> but it's really cute. See, I have the straps just hanging because I couldn't get them. And it's one of the ones that you pull over your head, so there's no zipper, but two pockets, which is nice. So this is probably the most comfortable jumper skirt that I own right now. It's super airy and comfy and not tight in any area. I like it. It flows really nice, too. Ah, flow, 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 flow. Okay, I'm wearing a white petticoat. Probably doesn't the right color to go with this outfit. Then I couldn't get this one on, partially because it's tiny, and the other thing is that I just couldn't get the straps like on right by myself. I need help to get into this outfit. Um, I could zip it up, but I got stuck about here by myself. If I had somebody else get it, I could probably get into it more, but it, it wasn't very like super flattering from what I could get on. And I think that might just be that the bra I'm wearing, my boobs are too big right now. Hopefully it'll look better once I can get into it if Dean can help me put it on. On the mannequin though, it's gorgeous. I love the way the skirt hangs. I love the pleats. I love everything about it. The straps in the back are really cute. They're just hell to get on right. And then from right here to right here, because like I said about my big shoulders, those big shoulders also include a big back. So this like is like super tight against me but the front fits like loosely so I don't understand but it's because these straps that I can't close it because this is like more than enough give in the front and not enough give in the back because of these side straps that are supposed to make this look so that kind of sucks and hopefully I can get it on because I really like it it has a zipper on this side then removable waist ties and I don't know if it has a pocket it might be one of my dresses that just does not have a pocket Wait, wait. Oh, it does. It has a pocket right here. So, 
yeah, I really like it. It's so pretty. It's like super, super pretty. I keep looking at it like, wow, it's so amazing. I love the gold details and the silver details in it. I love it so much. I forgot to mention that this dress comes with a cute collar too. I've always wanted an angelic pretty choker, but it's a cute little like tied collar with some stars on it. I really like this. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Tell me which dress you like the best. I love this dress so much. It's so gorgeous. I just hope I can actually get myself into it. If not, I'm not going to sell it because I'm going to make myself fit into it. I love this dress. This is also really cute. I feel like I'm about to be burned in like God's hellfire. No, that'd be Satan's hellfire. I don't know. Wearing this does not feel right, but I like it at the same time. And um, Dolly Dot's obviously amazing and wonderful. I'm glad that I got these dresses on sale. Hopefully I can sell my other dresses, which, you know, I'll link down there. They're for good prices. Free shipping in the U.S. Um, the link will be down in the video description. If you have any questions, again, don't feel afraid to leave a comment down below and I will try to answer it as fast as possible. If you haven't already, thumbs up this video if you liked it, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Stay spooky. Bye!